So in these kind of questions, uh, we have to frame equations. Barry buys 200 pieces of stationery for this much amount. So there are two things happening. There are two things happening. You are buying certain things. One second. Of the 200 pieces of stationery, X of them are rulers that cost 50 pesa each. And Y of them are pens that cost 20 pesa each. So the rulers are X in number and pens are Y in number. So what is the total of X and Y? How many he is buying? 70. Right? 200 pieces. So therefore, my first equation will become x plus y equals to 200. Okay. Is that thing clear? Yeah, yeah. I thought you were asking how much. Okay, bye bye. Now, what is the cost of one ruler? One ruler is 50 pesa each. And one pen is 20 pesa each. Can you see that? And total money which I am spending is 76. Okay. Now the unit should be same. If this is in pesa, this should be converted into pesa. Or this should be converted into uh, the same unit over here. If it is dollar, keep it dollar or rupees or euro, pound, whatever it is. Is that thing clear? Yeah. Now you tell me, you want to convert this into this or this into this? I think we'll convert euros too. So this I will convert it into Pesa multiply by 100. So this becomes 7600 Pesa. Okay. okay. Now, each cost of ruler is 50 Pesa. If one ruler is 50 Pesa, then what is the cost of seven rulers? What you will do? You can consider uh -huh. 50 rupees. One ruler is 50 rupees. What will be the cost of seven? Quickly. You just have to seven into five, 50, right? So seven into 50. And what is the cost of X rulers in that case? X into 50. Okay. Make sense? Yeah. This is X ruler cost. On similar note, what will be the Y pens cost? Y into 20. Make sense? Yes. Now, total is 7600. So therefore my second equation becomes 50x plus 20y equals to 7600. That's the second equation. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just use my GDC to solve this thing. You know how to solve this thing? how to solve um, the equations other than n solve n solve is used when we have one variable right now there were two variables more than two variables can also be solved now if you go to this 
calculator generally i have already done trying this thing one second let me just show you where to start from directly you can uh, go to this calculator and uh, put this thing in menu okay go to menu you can also do it with me and go to algebra okay if you go for numer numerical solve that is n solve go to solve system of linear equation okay so if you go over here number of equations there are two equations so write two over here it is two already given now x and y variable the our question was in x and y now so we'll get keep x and y if it is three variable write x y z right now we'll keep two okay that's how it will come automatically the first box will represent the first equation second box will represent the second equation so first equation was x plus x plus y equals to 200 and the second equation was 50x plus 20y equals to 7600 understood you just need to press enter answer is coming in 120 and 80 <clears throat> so x value is 120 and y value is 80 that means the question was asking how many rulers he will buy he will be able to buy 120 rulers and 80 uh, pence with 76 euros or pounds I don't, I don't remember the simple it is pounds i guess is that thing clear yeah so we'll be able to buy 120 rulers and 80 pence yes 80 pence can you see it's super easy you just need to frame equation and rest is calculator so i'm just stopping this thing